Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video and today guys I'm gonna be showing you guys how to install shaders onto your minecraft game Now just like my last modding video I recorded both of these videos back to back and it failed on me because I was recording the wrong screen the entire time Sadly, but anyways regardless of the point go to Google and search into your search bar 1.12 Minecraft shaders click on the first link right here and it should take you to a shadersmods.com page super cool probably one of the best pages here for just shader mods obviously there's other pages around the internet but I think this is the best and the biggest community here i'm gonna go ahead and pick cuda i think this one looks pretty cool honestly kind of change it kind of changes it up makes it look a little bit nicer so i'm just gonna go ahead and go with this one now go ahead and scroll all the way down to the bottom to find the download link the newest version is this one right here cuda shader v6 5.26 click on it and let the ad fly page run make sure to disable your ad block just because this is how these people make their money always say it and I always will just because I think it's fair once the five seconds are over depending on who you're downloading off of some people are just gonna download right away and then some people are gonna give you another link that you have to click download on but anyways go ahead and drag it onto your desktop if you don't have a second screen go click on your file Explorer and it should be right here in your downloads anyways now that that's done go ahead and click on your minecraft launcher now one thing you are going to need before you install the actual shader you're going to need Optifine. If you guys don't know how to do that, I will have a link down in the description to a playlist that will show you exactly how. There should be a video on there that says how to download and install Optifine. So go ahead and get that first. Now, once you got that, make sure you have a profile with the actual Optifine on it. Go into your launch options, pick that profile or any profile, and then basically go over here to the game directory, click on this little green arrow, and your .minecraft folder should pop up. I would actually go ahead and pin that if I were you guys, just so like that, you can have it here at all times so when you do want to add mods shaders you know texture packs anything you have it right here and you don't have to go through the whole process so go down to where it says shader packs open that folder up and then just go ahead and drag the thing that you just downloaded into here boom it should be something like that go back save the profile click on minecraft and then load minecraft up once minecraft loaded up let's actually go ahead into my creative tutorial world um because i want to show you guys exactly what it looks like so how to actually use it Go ahead, why is it telling me how to move? I've been on this world a million times, bud. Thanks, oh, okay, okay, whatever. Anyways, go ahead into options, video settings, and down to shaders, and then go ahead and select the one that you just downloaded. I think we just installed CUDA, so let's go ahead and click on that one. Click done, 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 and back to game. And I'm not gonna lie, I think this is one of those shaders that is less intensive on your computer. Um, the water is very nice, but the blocks just seem pretty normal to me. It doesn't look like that much of an intensive um, shader. Let me actually go ahead and check my frames. Um, it's kind of intensive actually, but it doesn't really change it up that much. I guess it's just because I'm used to working with shaders now, and the last couple videos that I have recorded have been with shaders on, so I guess I'm just adjusted to the shaders look, and it doesn't really look like it changed too much. But I know to you guys, um, it will definitely make a difference. Obviously, there's going to be shaders out there that are going to be better for your computer and going to be worse for your computer, more intensive on your computer, and less intensive on your computer. So if you do have a crappier computer, and I'm not trying to diss anybody's computer off because I personally don't have the best computer ever. You know, I have an R9 390 and, you know, an i3 chip. So I really don't have nothing out of this world. But if you do have a less quality computer, then just go ahead and less intensive on your computer. So, so just go ahead, go to Google, and search up 1.12 shader packs for less well for less intensiveness or less intensive shader packs or something like that and it should pop up but anyways that really wraps up today's video hope you guys did enjoy it if you did a thumbs up would be greatly appreciated of course comment down below what you guys want to see next on the channel and if you're new around here make sure to subscribe it would always be greatly appreciated but anyways thank you guys so much for watching hopefully you guys enjoyed i'll catch you guys later on another video peace